Let me say good morning to you all and welcome to the Douglas Charles Airport. On behalf of the management and of that, the board and management of DASPA, let me welcome you to this commissioning ceremony of two modern security screen X-ray equipment funded by the CARICOM Development Fund through the efforts of the government of Dominica. Safety and security are critical to the growth and development of any nation. The proper functioning of our ports of entry contributes positively to the national economy and national security. Security screening is a major component of aviation security. And so the screening of all passengers and the baggage is recognized as an essential element of the aviation security measures advocated by the International Aviation Organization, that's IKO, in order to ensure that unauthorized persons and all restricted articles do not enter a security restricted area or an aircraft. The screen of passengers and baggage may be carried out by manual searches, the use of metal detectors, X-ray equipment or other detectors of explosives and dangerous substances, or by a combination of manual procedures and equipment. In the interest of facilitating travel, the number of passengers and baggage to be manually searched can be significantly minimized by using modern screening equipment in conjunction with appropriate procedures conducted by well-trained and skilled personnel. Chapter 4 of Annex 17 of the Convention on International Civil Aviation, commonly referred to as the Chicago Convention, mandates each contracting state to implement preventive security measures consistent with international standards and recommended practices to safeguard civil aviation from acts of unlawful interference. A major component of these preventive security measures is the screening of passengers, cabin, and whole baggage. And so contracting states are obligated to ensure that passengers and other persons, together with items carried prior to entry into airport security restricted areas serving international civil aviation, are subject to screening and security controls. And so Dominica, as a small state, must comply with those international standards and recommended practices in an exempting of ICAO and document 8973. I am not sure what Erika had outside on the day of the 27th of August 2015, but it seems that whatever Erika had outside, she left it outside for too long. And so she unleashed water like we had never seen before. And we all know the devastation that was caused, and as a result, we lost all our technical security equipment at the Douglas Charles Airport. A few weeks later, with a Herculean effort by a number of stakeholders under the management of DASPA led by the CEO, Mr. Badwill, activities at the airport resumed shortly thereafter. With no technical equipment available, security officers have to manually search every bag going out to ensure that no dangerous or restricted articles entered the security restricted area or an aircraft. Manual screening went on for over 12 months. And um, as tough as it was, the officers persevered and did an exceptional job. I am proud to report that to date, we have had no negative report from any regional or international airport official that there was a security incident originating from Dominica. Neither did they intercept any dangerous goods 
at the airport which originated from Dominica. I commend the security officers for I commend the security officers and the security department for their devotion and commitment to duty. There's an old saying, every disappointment is a blessing. That may have held true for the Dominica Air and Seaport Authority. So in October 2016, we were blessed with this modern X-ray equipment, which we put into immediate use. The introduction of this technical equipment has significantly reduced the screening time and minimized the number of physical search conducted by our security screeners. And we're talking about uh, Smith High Scan 100-100V for whole baggage screening and Smith High Scan 6040 for um, carry-on baggage screening and we are so grateful for those pieces of equipment. The board and management and staff of DASPA are very elated and welcome you to this commissioning ceremony. God bless you. <laughs>